we're here in the Great Sandy Desert uh, working with Environs Kimberley and the Barragoo Rangers. The last few years we've been working on bilbies and more recently we decided to focus some attention on night parrots. So WWF and Environs Kimberley have come out and supported the rangers in these biodiversity surveys. We've brought equipment like uh, sensor cameras and bioacoustic devices to listen for the night parrots. And extraordinarily, um, a couple of months ago, uh, we've got a photo of a night parrot flying across one of the sensor cameras. It's a small green parrot with a yellow belly and large head. It could only be a night parrot. We surveyed in areas that the traditional owners knew there were night parrots there um, for thousands of years. Only my grandfather told me about, about the night parrot. He seen it, but I didn't see it. And the night bird was, uh, he, had a, he had a song. You know, when it, like I you walk, you wobble. Yep. And I had a dandruff, we don't know, it, it was sacred. Yep. It's a night bird. We seem to have captured a photo of the night parrot flying by one of our cameras one of the first nights, so it was very exciting for everybody to finally see a picture of it because we haven't seen one in our lifetime. The significance of this species being recorded in this country cannot be underestimated. This is the third population that are known by Western scientists. There is one in Queensland and one in southern Western Australia. Mm -hmm.